last night on the town is back in Virginia Beach this year. Of course, it does come as COVID-19 is once again surging. News 3's Anthony Sabella live at Town Center with organizers and what they're saying about it. And by the way, Anthony, I have to point out, um, we talked about the 90s band that's going to be performing. Whoa, I'm guessing it's like Joey Lawrence from Blossom. It's whoa, whoa. Yeah. Yeah, you know, and after I said that earlier today, I was like, I totally missed an opportunity to go, whoa, but here we are. Uh, I do want to switch gears real quick because of the obvious news of the surge in COVID-19, the Omicron variant, the record breaking day we had yesterday. And I talked to the organizers of the event and they say it certainly is something that they are concerned about heading into tomorrow night. But the hope is the fact that the event is outdoors, that that'll make things safer. And they say, you know, they certainly can't mandate masks. They can't make people wear masks outside, but at the same time, they are encouraging them so people can be as safe as possible tomorrow night. So just want to put that note out there because this is such a huge event. This is an event that in the past has brought thousands of people down here to the Virginia Beach Town Center area and it's free and open to the public. So there's a lot of reasons people might want to come out here. Now, here in the stage area where I am right now, 90s cover band, whoa, is going to lead things off. And that was the worst Joey Lawrence impression ever. Uh, but after they're done performing, then the DeLoreans, of course, a local favorite, is going to take the stage and lead us to midnight and the beach ball drop. Now, this is always a fun time, and I'm told it was actually very, very sad to have to cancel this, this event last year due to the pandemic. Local restaurants now excited at the event's return and the chance to bring some people in. All of them have specials for the evening. They stay very busy. They've struggled just as every restaurant around the United States. And so they've struggled. The hotels have struggled, um, but they're they're very optimistic about our future. Um, we know we take a couple of steps forward and a few steps back um, with the pandemic. <sighs> So if you'd like to come out, everything actually starts at six o'clock tomorrow night at Town Center's Fountain Plaza. They're, they're going to have some music. They'll have a dance contest and other entertainment. Again, all free and it's all really good for the family, I'm told. And then everything moves over here to Columbus Street at nine o'clock. And I don't know if you can see behind me, but they are well on their way to putting up the stage here this morning. So that's very exciting. We just saw them put up a big portion of it and they're just working hard to get everything ready for tomorrow night. The street, Columbus Street here, already shut down too. So lots of work still to be done. Lots to see if you want to come out here to last night on the town tomorrow night. Again, everything kicking off at six o'clock in the town center plaza. Uh, for more information about this event, there are also some other events as well as the events that ended up getting canceled. Just go to our website, WTKR.com. Reporting live here in Virginia Beach, Anthony Sabella, News 3.